Is Stadia worth it in 2021? When Stadia first released, it had so many issues with resolution and frame rate. Twenty-two games released on Stadia when the console first released, with very few exclusive games to Stadia. Then Google finally fixed Stadia in April 2020, adding more features and making the Pro membership better. Stadia was still lacking in games though. For months they didn't have enough new games coming out. Then finally, Stadia got a lot more good games in the end of 2020. The best way to play Stadia on a TV is to get Stadia Premium Edition. And also, you need at least 10 megabytes per second internet. I'm gonna show you some clips of how Stadia runs Hitman 2 and some other games. 